Watch and play every game like it could be your last for a few months at least. Sadly, that's the fate of Australian and world sport right now. And it must be a strange feeling for the Newcastle and Melbourne City players as they prepare to step out onto McDonald Jones Stadium, knowing that FFA CEO James Johnson has called a press conference for 10 a.m. tomorrow morning when the A-League season will almost certainly be put on hold. There's a few players that appear to be uh, struggling physically at the moment on the quick backup. Of course, it doesn't happen too often in the A-League that you play on a Friday night and then play on a Monday. Been away from home for a long time as well. Petratos, will he use O'Toole this time? He turns down the debutant. Now he wants him. O'Toole played it cleverly enough. Big chance, O'Donovan! Well, that would have lit up the night. Teed himself up for the bicycle kick and feels like he should have banged it home for his 49th A-League goal. Well, the, it needed the deflection on the cross from Conor O'Toole. It does well to get past Susayeta. And this little deflection uh, played O'Donovan in via Ugarkovic. Spectacular effort. Ledley to the voice of Petratos. Is there a killer ball right at the end of this? Nick Fitzgerald dancing his way through. And what a way to round off the first half. Nick Fitzgerald finishes off superb lead up play from Dimi Petratos. And he has his 17th A-League goal. Atkinson again. Eventually to Wales. He was upset he didn't get it about 15 seconds earlier. From Berenguer. The ball out there quickly for Noon. All the way through and there is the equaliser. He sent it wide. Arrived at the back post. Florin Berenguer features twice in the movement. And they are level with 20 minutes to go, Melbourne City. Risky pass from top or Stanley. Houlihan made it work in the end. But how good's it been watching Wes Houlihan play since he's come back from injury? Absolutely. A shame that he wasn't there due to injury for much of the campaign. Here's Miller. Lays it off for Fitzgerald. Houlihan screaming for it. Miller. Movement of Petratos, open up space for him. Now a beanie. No turn and shot available to him. Yugarkovic. Oh! He scores for the Jets with a worldie. Tom Glover wrong-footed. And Steven Yugarkovic from Nikolai Topol Stanley range. May well have capped off the night for Newcastle here. As they hunt that two-goal buffer. Brilliant skill, Bernie Abini out in front of Miller. Men over at the back post. Matt Miller gets a defender on the deck. Tees up his man. Oh, there's the save with the opposite hand. Tom Glover keeps out Fitzgerald shot. Well, how good is this? Credit Carl Robinson as well for the knowledge, reading the stats pack and realising this might be Glenn Moss's only chance to bring up a milestone. Luis Italiano knows what's on. He deserves this moment. Game number 250 in the A-League. Such a stalwart. Glenn Moss. Three minutes of stoppage time are up. Newcastle with a win at home keep their finals hopes alive if indeed the season does continue beyond tonight. Steven Ugarkovic with the match winner after a goalkeeping mistake by Tom Glover who then produced some heroics in goal to give City a chance. But in the end, no joy for the visitors. Full time at McDonald Jones Stadium, Newcastle 2, Melbourne City 1. Stay safe.
everyone.